Rabatoto. Thank you, Jesus. Well, we we trying to go live on our YouTube Thank you, live Jesus. stream, so um, we don't know how that's gonna work, but we gonna Thank try it Jesus. anyway. <laughs> so Glory until we get this hallelujah. thing down pat, y'all bear with us. Thank you. Until Lord. we get it down pat. Glory, hallelujah. hallelujah. Until we get it down pat. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Greater is he. Uh -huh. That he that is in the world. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Yes. Thank oh, you, Jesus. We're gonna have to figure out figure this thing out, but Thank it's you, there. It's there. Okay. Uh, we just gotta make it till the, the screen gets a little wider. Thank you. Because uh, I think Jesus. this is about the uh Second time we've tried to go live here. Thank you, Jesus. But anywho, oh, uh, God, praise God. Praise anyway, God. <laughs> let us get to the to the order of the day. Praise God. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. And that is, uh, where are we going today, honey? Judge, Judges 6. Judges 6. Sixth chapter. The 6th chapter? Yeah. Uh-huh. And where, where are we starting at? Verse 1, go ahead. Verse 1, with the, the evil altars and the... The evil altar and the stripper, stripper pole. pole. Parental... Discretion Praise is advised. God. If you have small Evil children, altar. we want you to make and sure the that the pole we'll be are, talking about. Today. We'll be talking about today. Praise God. So we Eva want you, altar. Uh -huh. Praise God. And the stripper and the pole stripper beside. Stripper pole it. beside. It. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you. Judges the sixth chapter. Praise God. Mm -hmm. Starting beginning from the first verse. Praise God. The Israelite did evil in the Lord's sight. So the Lord handed them over to the Mennonites for seven years. Mm -hmm. Praise God. The Mennonites were so cruel that the Israelites made hiding places for themselves in the mountains and the caves and strongholds. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Whenever the Israelites planted their crops, marauders, marauders from Midian, Amalek, and the people of the east will attack Israel. Mm. Camping in the land and destroying crops as far away as Gaza. Mm. They left the Israelites with nothing to eat. Taking all the sheep, the goats, cattle, and donkeys. Mm -hmm. These enemies, hordes, coming with their livestock and tents were as thick as locusts. They arrived on groves of camels, mm -hmm. too, mm -hmm. too numerous to count. And they stayed until the land was stripped bare. Mm -hmm. So Israel was reduced to mm -hmm. starvation by the Mennonites. Then the Israelites cried out to the Lord for help. They cried out to who? For the Lord for help. They cried out to the Lord for help. For help, praise uh -huh. God. What is that? When they cried out to the Lord, when they cried out to, to the Lord because of the Midian, the Lord sent a prophet mm -hmm. to Israelites. He said, this is what the Lord, the God of Israel says. Mm -hmm. I brought you up out of slavery in Egypt. I rescued you from the Egyptians and from all who oppress you. I drove out your enemies and gave you their land. I told you, I am the Lord, your God. You must not worship the gods of the Amorites mm -hmm. in whose land you not live. Mm. But you have not listened uh -oh. to me. You didn't listen. They did not they listen, didn't listen to him, praise oh my God. God. Hallelujah, mm -hmm. praise God. Then the angel of the Lord came and sat beneath the great tree of Ophrah, mm -hmm. which belonged to Joash, the mm -hmm. clan of Abazar. Mm -hmm. Gideon, son of Joash, was threshing wheat mm -hmm. at the bottom of the wine press to hide the grain. They had, they the, had to hide the grain. They hide the grain oh from the Mennonites. Mm -hmm. The angel of the Lord appeared to them and said, Mighty hero, mm -hmm. Lord is with you, sir. Gideon replied, Mighty hero, Lord, if the Lord is with us, get in reply. If the Lord is with us, why has all this happened to us? Wait, wait a minute. You mean in, in verse 13 it said, Gideon said unto him, and in, in uh, Oh, my Lord, if the Lord is with us, yeah, why has if I'm saved and sanctified and filled with the Holy Spirit, why ha why then has all this happened to us? Why am I going through all this? Why stuff? am I going through all this? Why the patterns and the cycles continue to show up you, in my life? Yeah, if 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 God is with if us. If God is with us. Oh, if I'm saved, sanctified, if and filled, I'm saved, with the Holy filled with the Holy Ghost. Okay, what does it say? And he said, and where are all the miracles? Where are all the miracles? Where the blessings? Where the miracles? Where they at? 
That's what Gideon our said. Our ancestors told us about. The ones that our ancestors told us yeah, about. Yeah, didn't they say the Lord brought us up out of Egypt? Uh-huh. But now the Lord has abandoned us. He done left us. And handed us over to the Mennonites. Uh-huh. Praise God. Said they were hiding their what? Food. Food. They, they was, was hiding, hiding their grain, praise God. Because the Midianites was coming to eat it up. Yeah, because oh they, they didn't listen to God. Where are all of the miracles? Where are all of the blessings? Listen, which our fathers told us about, saying, Did not the Lord bring us up from Egypt? But now the Lord has forsaken us and delivered us over into the hand of the Midianites. Of the Midianites. Oh, my goodness. Praise God. Hiding in mountains, uh -oh. caves, yeah. and strongholds. Uh-huh. Praise God. These are the places that the enemy have us. Mm -hmm. He have us in caves. We in caves hide. We in stronghold, places stronghold. We in mountains hide mm -hmm. from the enemy, praise God. Mm -hmm. Because the enemy coming to take what belongs to you, praise God. Mm -hmm. And then what? He brings he bring starvation. Mm -hmm. He called Israel the star. My God. Praise God. Star, praise He said, why? He said, this is why it happened to them. The Israelites did, did evil. They did evil. In the sight of the Lord. Oh, my God. They did evil in the sight of the Lord. Mm -hmm. We need to examine ourselves and think about the thing, uh, 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 what we're doing. Mm -hmm. Is it evil? Do it affect God? Mm -hmm. Do it affect God's kingdom? Mm -hmm. Do it affect this will? Mm -hmm. Do it affect this law? He said they did evil in the sight of the Lord, and the Lord turned them over to their enemies. For seven years, seven. for seven long years, he turned them over, praise God. So what do you think about if we do evil? Do God, is God going to turn us over My God. or release us to our enemies, praise God, when we don't listen? He said they cried out for help. Mm -hmm. Then Israelites cried out to the Lord for help, praise God. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah, praise God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Mm -hmm. The mighty hero, mm -hmm. the Lord is with you. Get it to where's the miracles? Where the miracles? Where the blessings? Where the blessings? You said you was gonna bless us with we have been blessed with all spiritual blessings in the heavenly realms. Mm. Where are they? All I see is the patterns and the cycles. Thank all you, I Jesus. see is continued divorce. Glory. All I see is continued sickness and disease. Mm -hmm. All I see is anti-marriage. Anti all I see is I, I keep uh, 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 having miscarriages. Uh -huh. All I see is is me and all my sisters can't none of us get a husband. Mm -hmm. We can have children, mm -hmm. but we can't have we we can't keep no husband. and can't get one. Right, something wrong. Something wrong in no. the bloodline. Something wrong in the bloodline. So follow the pattern. Follow the Pattern. Come on here. Follow Praise the pattern. God. So Go we're going to drop down the, the 25th verse. The 25th, 625? 625. Okay, what does it say? He said, that night the Lord said to Gideon, okay. take the second bull. Is it 25? Yeah. That night the Lord okay. said to Gideon, take the second bull from your father, her, the one that is seven years old. Pull down your father out of the bell. Mm-hmm. And cut down the Asher pole. The who? The Asher pole. Cut down the Asher, Asher pole. Standing beside it. Standing beside the altar. The Asher pole. What he said? Hallelujah. Go ahead. Then build an altar to the Lord your God here on the hilltop. Mm -hmm. Sanctuary. Land the stones carefully sacrificed. Mm -hmm. The bull as a burnt offering on the altar. Mm -hmm. Use it as fuel to the wood or the Asher pole you cut down. Mm-hmm. So Gideon took 10 of his servants and did as the Lord commanded. Mm -hmm. But he did it at night because he was afraid of the other members of his father's household mm -hmm. and the people of the town. Early that next morning, mm -hmm. as the people of the town began to stir, someone discovered that the altar of Baal, what? Had, the altar of Baal okay. had been broken down uh -huh. and the asher pole beside it had been cut down. Uh -huh. In their place, a new altar mm -hmm. had been built. Mm. And on it were the remains of the bull that had been sacrificed. Mm. The people said to each other, who did this? And after asking around and making careful search, they learned that it was Gideon, the son of Joash. Oh. Bring out your son. Bring him out. The man of the town demanded Joash. He must die for destroying the altar of Baal mm. and for cutting down the astral pole. My God. But Joash shouted to the mob that confronted him. Mm -hmm. Why are you defending Baal? Will you argue his case? Whoever pleases his case will be put to death by morning. 
If Baal truly is a god, let him defend himself. Uh -huh. If he truly a god, if he's a, if he a god. god, let him defend himself and destroy the one who broke down his altar. Mm. From then on, Gideon was called Jerubal, Jerubal, which means let Baal defend himself because he broke down Baal's altar. He broke his altar down. He broke his altars down. So the Lord told Gideon, mm -hmm. tear down the altar. He said, the reason why you having problems in the bloodline, mm -hmm. the reason why the patterns and the cycles are continuing right now with the Israelites mm -hmm. is because of your father's wicked what? Altar. Altar. And the Asherah pole that he had beside. Beside the altar. Uh-huh. So this is the reason. Mm -hmm. See, and all through scripture, the Lord kept telling the Israelites, what? listen, the Lord kept saying to them, listen, you, 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 can't, you can't keep doing this. Mm -hmm. You can't keep doing this. It's saying, mm -hmm. uh, uh, okay, in 2 Kings mm -hmm. 21, 3 to 7, he said, for he rebuilt the high places mm -hmm. that Hezekiah, his father, had destroyed. And erected altars of Baal, listen, and made an Asherah as King Ahab, king of Israel, had done, and worshiped all the hosts of heaven. I need to go back to 2 Kings so that I can. Uh, 2, 2 Kings. Kings 21. Okay. 2 Kings 21. Y'all turn to 2 Kings 21. 21. 2 Kings 21. 21. All right. And beginning at verse. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'm going to start at verse 1. Manasseh was 12 years old when he became king, and he reigned 55 years in Jerusalem. His mother's name was Hepazibah. And he did evil in the sight of the Lord, mm. according to the abominations of the nations whom the Lord had cast out before the children of Israel. For he rebuilt the high places, mm. which Hezekiah, his father, had destroyed. Hezekiah, his father destroyed. Hezekiah, his father destroyed him. He raised up altars for Baal, mm. listen, and made a wooden image, an Asherah pole, mm. as Ahab, king of Israel, mm. Israel, had done. And he worshipped all the hosts of heaven mm. and served them. And served them. Uh-huh. He also built altars in the house of the Lord. Mm. Of which the Lord has said in Jerusalem, I will put my name. And he built altars for all the hosts of heaven mm. in the in the two courts of the house of the Lord. Mm. Okay. He did a, all kind of wicked things. He made his son pass through the fire. Mm. And, and, and um, he made his son pass through the fire. He practiced soothsaying mm. and used witchcraft. Mm. He consulted spirits and mediums. Mm. So y'all saying witchcraft ain't real. It's real. He practiced it's sorcery. It's right here in the scripture. Divination. He practiced sorcery. Divination. Consulted with mediums. Mediums. Psychics. Psychics. He did much that was evil in the Lord's sight. In the Lord's sight. Arousing his anger, praise yes, God. Yes, he did. Arousing anger. But look, uh -huh. praise God. Gideon. It came through his father bloodline. Uh huh. Now Hezekiah. Uh huh. What did it say? Hezekiah. Hezekiah son. Hezekiah uh, he, destroyed. He, 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 Hezekiah destroyed the altars, but uh, he built the pagan shrines. Uh -huh. His father Hezekiah had destroyed. Yeah. He constructed the altars of Baal and set up Ashtaroth. Yes, he did. Just as King Ahab of Israel had mm -hmm. done. He mm -hmm. also bowed before all the powers of heaven. Praise mm -hmm. God. Praise God. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. Uh huh. Who in the world? Okay. Who in the world is wh who was Asherah? Asherah. What did that pole represent? Mm. What did Asherah represent? What did the pole represent? Okay. It said, who was Asherah? Mm. A Asherah was a Canaanite goddess. A Canaanite goddess. It was a goddess. Was a goddess. In Israel. Back in the old in the old day. Asherah was a Canaanite goddess or God, also known as the Queen of Heaven. Mm. Which is the demonic, which is a demonic principality and supposed to be the consort of El, the mm. supposed creator of the universe. Mm. Suppose. They were usually constructed on high places mm. like mountains, hills, mm. groves. Places mm. of quiet to worship in the groves. Mm. This is what they did with these things in the groves. Uh huh. The Canaanite, this is what they did. The Canaanite took trees, 
and fashioned them mm. into female forms. Mm, female forms. This tree. goddess. So that, that in, 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 inside of the grove, they would cut the trees and fashion them into to how a goddess, how a, a female uh, body parts would look. In, mm. in, 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 in back back there. He said the Canaanite took trees and fashioned them into female forms. Okay? Listen how they was fashioned. They were seduction. They were mm. seductive. Seductive. And they were de they were designed mm. to elicit desires within the worshiper. See? Mm. That the desires come out. Why well, I want to watch porn? Why do I want to uh, be an adulterer? Why do I constantly fornicate? Mm. Why uh, uh, am I uh, 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 dabbling in uh, same people, mm -hmm. two people? Why I'm doing that? Why yeah. the the Asherah pole is speaking? The Asherah pole is that speaking. That Asherah pole is, is 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 talking. Okay, that Asherah pole was for the for the for for, for, for sexual things for, mm. for 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 um seduction for mm. um um um. Uh, to, to, to bring the evil desires out of the human heart. Mm. Uh huh. She wow. was the God of the Canaanites. The God of the Canaanites. That's what that Asherah pole is. A God. A God. It's a goddess. A deity. A deity. And that's the same thing we, we worship in the day. She was a God of the Canaanites. Mm. The same God. Listen. Listen to this. She was worshipped mm. by that pole was all throughout <clears throat> Israel. Oh, Let me give you a couple of more scriptures before mm. we dive di deeper into that. Mm. Um, okay. okay. Let me read this then. Oh, go ahead and read it, huh? Ashapol was a, a, a fertility, a goddess of fertility. Okay. As sexualized, imagine of a woman. She represents all types of perversion. That's what she represents? She represents all types of perversion. Mm -hmm. Porn. My. The scripper pole. My God. That we have today. Uh-huh. That what it represents. The scripper pole that we have today, praise God. That have so many men under control. Yeah. Up under, up under the power, praise God, of this Asher. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Asher, praise God. That's the scripper pole, praise God, where the athletes can't stay out of the clubs. Mm -hmm. Because they got they, something drawing them. Mm. It's something drawing them into the clubs to watch the women, praise God, dress seductive and, and, and maybe naked and, 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 and out of control. Yeah. The spirit had them out of control with lust. Yes. The scripper pole that represent it's an altar that destroys men causing them to be out of control sexually. Not normal. Mm -hmm. Out of control. Mm -hmm. This astral yeah. This goddess. This altar. This altar. Uh huh. That still serving the day. Still speaking. We still today. looking up to them today. Praise yes. God. Not normal. Craving appetites. Yes. That come from hell. Oh my God. The appetites come out of the pit of hell. Mm -hmm. From this goddess. Mm. From this altar. Praise God. That we still serving in the day. Praise God. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. We have all types. That why we that's why we have all types of porn sites, mm -hmm. locations, mm -hmm. stripper clubs, mm -hmm. HBO, mm -hmm. so many places that the Asher God is at all around the world. Cinemax. Cinemax. If they still have it, I don't even all know if around they still the world. Cinemax. Women dressing seductively because of the spirit. This goddess uh -huh. that wants to be seen. Seen? That is yeah. She, she wanna, wanna be, be seen. seen. Yeah. Oh. Astra wanna be seen. Okay. This goddess wanna be seen, praise God. My God. And it's a desire for her to be seen, for you to lust after her. Mm, to lust. To lust after her, uh -huh. praise God. Yeah. Hallelujah. We can see it everywhere. Everywhere. In, in every nation, uh -huh. in every town, uh -huh. in every city, uh -huh. everywhere we go, all around the world. Uh -huh. Astra is moving. Yes. Speaking. Speaking. That altar God. is speaking. That's the purpose of how she dresses. Uh -huh. That's the purpose of how she dresses. Uh -huh. To cause extreme lust. To cause extreme lust. Extreme lust mm -hmm. burning within yeah. you mm -hmm. from the spirit realm. Mm -hmm. From the spirit realm. This coming out of the spirit realm. Yes. Entering into you, praise God, oh God. Because you looking at this goddess. Yes. Praise God. She everywhere. She influenced you. She influenced you. Looking at her. You worshiping her. Praise uh -huh. God. You worship that goddess. Yes. Because you obey her. 
Right. You obey, you obey that her. goddess because you do what that goddess tell you, you do. You do what that goddess tell you. You to worship do. that goddess. You worship that goddess. Yeah, you yeah, yeah, you'll be influenced by that influenced goddess. Influenced by this goddess, uh -huh. praise God, control. The goddess of seduction. Seduction. The goddess of lust. A lust. The goddess of perversion. A perversion. The goddess of prostitution. Praise God. That is the goddess. That's the goddess. That you are worshiping. That's the goddess you worship. My working. God. Praise God. It is something causing you it's something causing you to dress like a stripper. It's, oh, what? it's something causing women to dress like a stripper. What's causing it's them? It's something to... causing them to dress like a stripper and a prostitute. How, what? What? It's the goddess. It's that goddess. It's the goddess Asher. It's that altar. It's the altar of Asherah. Asherah, that Asherah pole. Asherah pole. Which is the modern day It's causing pole. you to dress like a stripper. Yes. It's causing you, when you look in the mirror, praise God, you desire the way you look. You like how you look. You like look. the way you look, praise you God. Like when but I it's look. a spirit on the inside Why of you, you causing that. That's the spirit desire that. You are Asher worship, desire that. You worship in that spirit. you When you show your nakedness. Yes. You worship that demon. Praise Every God. Every time you show your nakedness to Thank the world, you, you worship in Asher. Asher, you worship here. and praise God. My God. Hallelujah, praise God. When you when you when you dress seductively, when you got your breasts hanging all out, uh -huh. that that's a, a altar calling you. Yes. The Asher altar calling you, yes. praise God. You married, worship praise God. Worship me today. You married. You got a husband, uh -huh. and you lead a house uh -huh. with your breasts all out. My God. That's a spirit of seductive. That's a you. That's a deduct, seductive spirit. Yes. Praise God. It's mm -hmm. operating from mm -hmm. an altar. Praise God. Mm -hmm. In this altar, they call it Asher. The Asher pole. The Asher pole. Yes. They say. Praise God. Tear the Asher down pole. Asher pole. Tear down the Asher pole. Uh -huh. And notice when they tore down the Asher pole, the whole town when went to Joash and said, "Bring him out. We're gonna kill him. We're gonna kill him. We're gonna kill him." Praise God. It'll bring you to murder. My God. It'll bring you the murder, praise God, the Asher pole. Mm -hmm. It'll cause you, praise God, to be so angry and lustful. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Listen, Hallelujah. In today's Western world and other parts of the world, the stripper or the dance pole is used in the same way. Mm. Women who perform erotic dances. Mm. So instead of the grove <laughs> image of a woman that's made from a tree or even a small female statue, or a pagan god, we have the stripper pole mm -hmm. and a live what? Mm -hmm. And a live Praise woman God. dancing on it. And a live woman dancing on it. See? It's the, that's the same deal. That's the Asher pole. That's the Asher pole. That's the Asher pole. Well, I don't go to the strip club, Praise but do God. you watch that mess on television? That's right. Well, I don't go to the strip club, but do you watch but, that mess on television? Uh -huh, but do you listen to the music that's filled with lust? That's right. Uh huh. So every time you listen to that music, mm. you know it's filled with lust. Filled with lust. What the boy say? Um, um, on Bear Bib DeVoe. What he say? This girl is poison. Poison. What in and those lyrics? Praise it's going to do anything for my spirit. Praise and you telling me the girl poison. The poison. Because of her big breasts and her big butt. Mm -hmm. That source right there is telling you. That's not the way to go. But I got to worship the Asher. It's an altar I got to her. worship that altar. That's what's pulling you to it's listen to It's an altar pulling her. That's pulling you to it's listen to It's an altar to it. pulling you. Yes. It's an altar pulling you to pick up your phone. Yes. It's an altar pulling you to go to porn on your phone. The altar speaking. It's an altar. It's an Asher. Asher. Uh -huh. Cold. Uh -huh. Praise God. Causing you, praise God, to be infused with lust. My God. Uh-huh. It's an altar, praise yeah. God. Mm -hmm. It was way back in the Old Testament. It's all the way in our modern day time right now. If you walk in the in the, in the um in the um in the mall and you see a store called Big Porias. Uh, Victoria, 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 secret, secret. What do you see? The images of the Asher the pole. Asher pole. Oh, it's just uh, 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 underwear. Yeah. But that's seduction. Seduction to the highest level. What is it doing? It's calling you. Right. It's calling you to that altar. To that altar. My God. God. It, it's, Jesus. It, it's it's a training. It's a training uh, session. Uh huh. to teach you how to be perverted. Teach you to be perverted. Yeah, it's teach you how to be perverted. Look like praise this. Praise God. Look like this, praise uh -huh. God. It teach you to go into different levels of a perversion, perversion. A sex, praise God. Uh -huh. It teach you that, praise this God. This thing is filthy. It's training you to do that, yes, praise it is. God. The astral. 
The God is ashes, the God of fertility, praise God. The God of perversion, the God of porn, praise God. My God. Hallelujah, praise God. It's the God. God of pornography. It's the God of pornography. It's the God of fornication. It's the God of everything that is perverted. Thank you, It Jesus. comes from the Asherah pole. From the Asherah pole. Which is our... In our day, it's that stripper pole. It's the stripper pole. And the things that come from it, which is lust. Which is lust. Uh, prostitution. Prostitution. That, that's an altar that's <clears throat> continuing to speak today. Continue. How does she speak? Praise God. Listen, she speak through music. She speak through movies. Movies. She speak through TV shows. And if you can sit she there. She speak through and billboards. It, billboards. Praise Asherah God. is speaking it's everywhere. And so when she went, listen, when you see the symbols, what she's saying, bow, bow down to me, worship me, show me all your breasts, show it to the other men. Let Amen. the other men see your cleavage, right. all your cleavage out. Let the other men see it. That's that, what that Asherah, you worship in that Asherah pole when you do that. Yeah, you worship in you that worship. deity. It's a goddess. Thank you, Jesus. And it's still alive and Praise well God. today. That is an altar we need to disconnect Praise ourselves God. from. These, these sitcoms, these television programs, these movies that we watch on Netflix and all this stuff, yeah. you create the atmosphere. It set the atmosphere in your home. Uh-huh. These spirits coming off of the screen into your home, into you, praise God, and they set the atmosphere in your home. Mm -hmm. They begin to create what they desire. Yes. Create what they desire, praise God. Yes. You never had a desire for no other man. Uh -huh. You never had a desire for another woman, uh -huh. praise God, but all of a sudden, you got a desire. My God. You got an appetite. My you got a taste God. for another man. And you married. You got a taste for another. That Asherah yeah. pole. Yeah, you got the Asherah pole. It's right beside Praise the God. altar. Thank you, Jesus. It's right beside the godly altar. Praise God. It's right beside the, the Asherah pole. Is right beside the godly altar. What is the godly altar? Mm. We are saved. We are sanctified. Mm. We are filled with the spirit. Mm. But yet that Asherah pole is continuing to speak in our mm. life. That Asherah pole is continuing. We continuing to worship that Asherah. Asherah because every pole. time you want to show your nakedness, you are obeying. You giving obey obedience, obedience to that God. To the Asher pole. You giving obedience the to that God. The stripper pole. My God. In the modern day. Yes. It's the stripper pole, praise yes. God. That's why you can dress provocative. Mm -hmm. That's why you can dress for, for, for eyes to be on you. Yes. Praise God. Mm -hmm. You want to look a certain way, praise yeah. God. You, you got to understand, you want to bring attention to yourself. To yourself. Praise God. That's a level of pride. Yes. That's a level of pride. You want to bring attention to the yourself, praise mm -hmm, God. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Pray. Not, not realizing, praise that God, you that are... you're dis disrespecting yourself and you disrespecting your spouse. The Lord. The Lord and the Lord. Number one, you disrespecting the Lord. Number two, you don't you have to be married. That's right. You, don't, you ain't got to be a married person to you. show yourself like that. That's right. You don't. You got a whole bunch of women out there. Praise they God. They say they Christians. They're but they can, they can, they can, they can say they Christians. But the first Shaka. thing when they walk up, and you see them, you got to, I got to look at your nakedness. They're I under don't control. Want to see your nakedness. They're well, under control. We are under control of that goddess. Of that goddess. Ba, 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 of Asher, praise, Asher, praise God. Asher we goddess. under control, yeah. praise God. Uh -huh. Those spirits, praise God, flowing, are coming off of that pole, which represents the stripper pole, into you, praise God, into your mind, into your thoughts, praise yes. God. Yes. Oh, hallelujah, That's praise God. That's what's happening. You can imagine the conversations mm -hmm. be going on between men. Uh -huh. You can imagine the conversations. Man, that be going today? on the women, praise yeah, God. Did man, did you see that man? Did you, did see, you that? see her man? man. And all that stuff. Uh -huh. That's coming from the Asher. That's coming from the Asher pole. Them the thoughts, them the Asher thoughts. Yes. Praise God. They're injecting them in your mind. And so when praise you do God. it, you Hallelujah. worship in that you God. You worship in that God. When you do it gives it, you the cravings. Yes. It gives you the appetites, uh -huh. praise God. Oh, uh -huh. my Sante Lee. Yes. You and your homeboy. You and your homeboy talking, man. Then you see her. Did you see her? <coughs> huh? Did uh -huh. you see her? Man, she got some nice ones on her. Poor Colossus. Boy, Sante. she blessed Me in the she back. Lord, look at her. And going to use the, the godly Sante. euphemism of blessed mm. to, to talk about a woman's behind. Oh, You're going to say it's blessed. It's blessed. She blessed, blessed in the back. What is that? Sante. What kind of stuff it's is that? Sante but we Christians, Sante. but we got the altar right beside Thank us. Thank you, Jesus. Then we got the altar right beside Okola. us. She bad. She bad. Oh, she bad Thank to the Lord bone. Jesus. Oh, my God. The Asherah. The Asherah. The Asherah had you sitting up with your wife. Uh -huh. The Asherah had the wife sitting up with her husband. They both watching the same thing, and they watching 
praise God. Now the Asher blessed saying she bad. She bad. Pray, no. but you she bad. Look at the, her. The husband calling her bad and, and the, the wife, wife calling her, her bad. bad. She bad. She bad. Look praise how she, God. Look at, look. That's a spirit. Praise yes. God. They enticing you. Praise uh -huh. God. They embracing you. Praise God. Uh -huh. They embracing you to the things they desire. They embracing you to lust. They embracing you to porn. They embracing you. Praise. It's a level of porn. Praise God. Yes, it remember, is. Remember, remember years ago I told you I got the magazine Victoria. Victoria Secret, Secret, yeah. getting it, uh -huh. And I got it and I looked through it. I said, oh, like I got to tell, I didn't know I I tell I my wife. I said, this porn. This so, a level of so, soft porn. Uh -huh. I said, this a level of porn. I said, I, I, we, we, she, she don't need to get this here. Uh -huh. She need to stop getting this here. Uh -huh. Praise my wife got upset. I was mad. She got upset. You know, because I was low in the spirit. Yeah, she got upset. So, oh, you can't handle it. Oh, that. you can't handle it? That's Asher speaking. You can't handle That's Asher speaking. That's Asher speaking. You can't handle it? But the Bible say, how can a man take fire in his bosom and not be burned? Yeah. Uh-huh. That's what it say. See, let me show you. You see that? This is ancient Canaan. That's the goddess that's the that they made in the. That's the Asherah that they made in the uh, in the groves. They mm. constructed it out of a tree. Mm. See the seduction. What's the first thing you see? You see her breasts exposed. Mm. That's what you see. You see her nakedness. And every time you walk out the house and all of this is exposed, you are worshiping this goddess. Yeah. This is the goddess you worship. She in the club. She in the club. She in the mall. She everywhere. She on the movie theater. She in the movie theater. So, cause when you see the, the nudity, when you see when you watching a sitcom, she in the or neighborhood. You, or you watching something on television, and you see when me and him watch it, trying to even watch a Christian movie on TV. Now we watching the movie. The movie good, and we getting all down into the movie and everything. Everything is copacetic, and then all of a sudden, we see a uh, cleavage. The woman's cleavage all over everywhere. That's mm. what we see. Right. And know what we do? I don't care how far we done got in the movie. I don't care how good the movie is. You know what we do? We disconnect from that we altar. We disconnect from that altar. We disconnect from Asherah. From Asherah, we praise God. We disconnect from seduction. Praise we God. We disconnect from lust. Yes. We disconnect from prostitution. We disconnect from that stuff. And this is the image right That's here. That's the image. Right here. That's the image. That's a that's an image breaking up marriages. That, they? Right, that, that Asherah. The Asherah. The stripper pole. The stripper pole. But this was what it was like back in ancient Canaan. Right. They worship Canaan. They Canaan, Canaanites worship this God along with Baal. They mm. worship the Asherah pole to mm. bring fertility to the land uh. so that they can have fertility. They, they brought rain and all of this stuff to the land. Mm. That's why Elijah locked up them heavens for three years because mm. they was worshiping other gods. And Elijah said it ain't going to rain another time mm. until it's at my word. And they, they, the reason why Elijah did that was to let the Israelites know Asherah ain't bringing you no rain. Mm. Baal ain't bringing you no rain. So he showed them Oh my God! But this is the image. I hope y'all can see it. Praise God! And look what's happening. Look, look what's up. look what. That's look, the image. That's the image. This is what you are bowing to every time you come out with all your breasts out. Right. That's the image men and women. Praise God! Have to deal with every Ancient day. Ancient Canaan. This is that spirit. The goddess. The Asherah. The Asherah in the, the pose, rose. In the pose. The stripper, stripper pose. My God. Praise God. Hallelujah. When they cried out to the Lord because uh -huh. of Midian, the Lord sent a prophet to Israel. He said, this is what the Lord, the God of Israel said. I brought you up out of slavery in Egypt. Uh -huh. That spirit, that God is that altar, praise God, desire to bring you into slavery. Mm -hmm. To put you into slavery. Mm -hmm. To bind you, praise God. And have you up under its control. Mm -hmm. In order for you to do the things it desires. You may not, you don't desire it, but that's the spirit that's the in spirit. you working. Yeah. It desired it. Yeah. It desired you to be seductive. Yes. It desired you to dress like that. Yes. It desired you to dress. It's, it's you, drawing you. It's drawing you. Because you are obeying it. Praise you God. You are obeying that goddess. You so obey you, it. you save and mm. you sanctify yeah. and you fill with, with, with the spirit. But Asherah is, is uh, the goddess Hallelujah. that is controlling your life. Right. It said you must not worship. You must not worship the God of the Amorites uh -huh. in whose land you now live, but you have not listened. We still today would not listen to the instructions. We're not listening to the law of God. We're not listening to his word, praise God. He said, don't worship other gods. And we constantly worship in the other gods. 
the other gods. Constantly worshiping them. Let me show you something. and I'm, We're going to come back to that. <clears throat> Go ahead. But I want to show you this right here. In Deuteronomy 16.21, mm. okay. it says, 16.21, Deuteronomy 16.21. Deuteronomy 16, 21. Okay, what is it? It says, do not set up any wooden Asherah pole mm. beside the altar. Mm. Listen, you build to the Lord your you God. You build to the Lord your God. Don't do that. Don't do it. Don't bow to that, de that demonic goddess. Mm. Don't build, don't have that thing in your life still. Don't have that wicked thing in your life still. Showing all of your goods. Showing mm. all of your... It's nakedness. I don't care how you look at it. Mm. It ain't nothing about it that's pretty. Atlanta housewife. Yeah. All, you see all of them with all of this out. Mm. And you just like them. You doing Praise what God. they do. You know why? Yeah. Because they under the uh, spirit. They doing what they normally do. Right. They worship the goddess of Asherah. They worship the but the ones of that are, are altars, we are uh, we are walking living altar. Back then they had the natural altar. Mm. Okay? Where, where the, the, the altar that they built. But we are the altar of the Lord because we are the temple of the mm. Holy Spirit. So mm. he said, do not set up any wooden Asherah pole do beside the altar you build to the Lord your God. How mm. many of us, how many of us are doing this? Mm. And you say that I'm 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 saved, sanctified, and filled with the Holy Spirit. But your influence, you influencing me. Because if you have any level of influence and mm. you come out like that, young women and young girls are gonna follow you. They're gonna follow you. That's what they're gonna do. They want My great grandbaby ain't gonna do it. They follow I'm gonna, you. I'm gonna teach her, don't do that. Praise don't, God. You ain't going to bow to that Asherah pole. Praise God. You're creating an altar. Yes, sir. You're creating an altar of the living God. Praise God. That's the altar they're going to pull in. That's the altar they're going to pull in. Whatever altar you creating, that's the altar that's going to pull them into whatever they into. Praise God. Yes. That altar, praise God, that's in our bloodline, that altar that's in your bloodline is pulling you. Mm -hmm. It's pulling you, praise God. Mm -hmm. It's pulling you. Somebody did that. In your family. Yes. Somebody acted like that. Somebody done that in your family, in your bloodline. Somewhere. Somewhere it was somewhere done. Somewhere in the bloodline. Because the altar is speaking. The altar is speaking. And so if God. you are continuing to come out and show nakedness, okay? What? Let me t ask this question. When you watch the videos, mm. uh, these um, uh, 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 music secular videos, yeah. these women are showing their nakedness. They right. worshiping that goddess. They right. dancing to that goddess. Right. They dancing to that lust. That's to, what they doing. They dancing to the ash. They dancing to the ash. To that goddess. Pole. To they, that pole. They bowing to that thing. They bowing to this. They bowing to that. That's what they bowing to. They bowing to that. Our ancient goddess. Our ancient goddess. That's what you bowing to. Yes. Every time I see all your cleavage out, yes. nakedness is what I see. I don't want to see your nakedness. You come down my timeline, I, I um, what I do, I um, snooze you for 30 days. Because mm. I don't want to see your nakedness. We're not, I don't want to choose to look at you. I don't want you. Praise God. Listen, we're not here, praise God. We're here to try to help, help you. Help you. That's it. We're here to try to help you. We're here to try to help you get where God wants you to be, praise God. We're here trying to sh show you, praise God, and the reason why you it. keep spinning wheels. Uh -huh. Why your wheels keep spinning you the same place, uh -huh. baby. The reason why it's a possibility why you don't have a husband. It's a reason, possibility, why you like another person the same way you are. Uh -huh. There's a reason. For, this astropole, it's this calling. goddess, mm -hmm. is calling you, praise God. And we're trying to help you a, a, a line it. We're trying to help you to line yourself up with the scriptures mm -hmm. and to show you, praise God, in the name of Jesus. These things are not com common. They may be, they may seem to be common. They may seem to be all right, but they are devilish. My God. They are devilish, praise God. These are spirits. These are ancient spirits, praise God. The Bible said, For we wrestle not against flesh, flesh and, and blood. blood. They ancient spirits. They ancient spirits. What spirit. did it say? It said ancient. Canaan. Canaan. Ancient. That's what, and, and what's the first thing it's showing? The nakedness of the goddess. 
the so nakedness. every time you show the nakedness, you worshiping this goddess. You worshiping that goddess. Ain't no if ands and buts about it. You Praise worshiping God. this goddess. Praise God. And they call they call the trees out the they call all the trees like that. That's why they call them groves. Yes. Because they carved the trees like that. Praise God. And they said destroy them. Mm hmm. Burn them up. Yes. Praise God. What you said? 1621 says? It was Deuteronomy 1621. Do not set up a, any wooden Asherah pole beside the altar you build to the Lord. To the Lord. Your God. We, so the Lord don't want his girls. Girls. His girls. He don't want his women. Hallelujah. He don't want his daughters of Zion mm. showing to the world their nakedness. Mm. He don't want us to, don't want to, 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 to bow and mm. worship that Asherah pole. It's right here in Deuteronomy 16 mm. 21. This ain't what we're telling you. This in the word. This is in the word of God. The word of God say, don't do that. Don't bring that thing beside the you. You are the temple of the Holy Ghost. Mm. Your, 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 we are a representative of a new kingdom. A new kingdom. We came out of that kingdom. So when you see the, the housewives, mm. know what they do? They influence us. They influence you. To dress like them. Yeah, they influence you. They influence us to look like them. They influence us to dress like them. Why do you think Beyonce, them, <laughs> and Taylor Swift and all of them be on the stage naked almost? Because they worship in that goddess. They worship and know the what God we do? Because they have influence. They influence in the masses. Praise God. They influence as children, people, Praise kids. God. They influence in grown-ups all over the Praise world. God. Guess who they are? What? They they Satan apostles. Yes. They Satan prophets. And they Satan teachers and evangelists. Mm -hmm. They going out doing the same thing we be, we doing. Mm -hmm. They going out winning souls for the enemy, mm -hmm. winning souls for the devil with the message that they got. Praise God. The influence that they have. They drawing you into the deeper darkness. Uh huh. Deeper darkness. Like they drawing you into worship. Worship. They want you to that this thing. This thing right here mm. wants your worship. Wants your worship. Wants your worship. You can be saved. You can be. You can be saved, and 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 you can be um. You can be saved. You can be a, a preacher. Mm -hmm. You can be a teacher. Mm -hmm. You can be uh, uh, any place in the fivefold ministry and all of that. And then uh, I get I get to see this. Mm. I get you not. You're not going to influence me. I'm not going to let this goddess influence me because I don't want to look like this demon. Mm. I don't want people to see me looking like that devil mm. right there. That's, her, that's the devil right there. That's the devil. Yeah, I don't want them to see me. Now, let me show you something. I'm Praise going back. God. Go ahead. I'm going back. Go on back. Mm -hmm. Praise God. It says, um, strip poles mm. is an altar. It's an altar. Uh-huh. They are an altar. They, there, there's the 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 the, the bear altar, and then there's the the other Asherah altar. Mm. Uh huh. Okay. Now watch this. I want to show y'all something. Okay. I don't know if I said this before, but I'm gonna read it again. Who was the Asherah? The Asherah was a Canaanite goddess or mm. god, also known as the Queen of Heaven. If you know anything about spiritual warfare, you know about this principality, the it's Queen of Heaven. Power. Okay. And it says, the Canaanite, okay, it says, they usually construct it on high places, mm. like mountains and hills, for a place of quiet to go out and worship before these things. Praise so that they, they could get what they want. And it says, the Canaanite took trees and fashioned them into female forms, just mm. like what I told you. This is what they did. Female form, that's a female it. form. This is how they fashioned them right here, into female form. Now watch this. Uh, trees and fashion in female form. They were they were seduction designed to elicit desires. Mm. What them desires coming up in you, okay? Within the worshiper, mm. you didn't you don't know that that's who you worshiping. Mm. When you showing all your cleavage, you worshiping that goddess. You that's who you worship. That goddess. And the Bible says in Deuteronomy, what I said just now, sixteen twenty one. Tear down that pole. Tear down that pole. Get that pole from over there. Come on here. Tear and then down. it says, she was the God of the Canaanites. Mm. Okay? The God, listen, this was the God mm. that Rahab, the prostitute Rahab. Mm. In where's that at? The prostitute Rahab worshiped. 
This is the God that Rahab worshiped. Remember Jericho? Mm. Jericho, when they went and tore down Jericho, and Rahab put out that cord uh, 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 when the spies came in. Where is that, honey? Where the spies mm. came in? Rahab. I thought I wrote it down. You wrote it down. I thought I did. Rahab. I thought it. I thought I wrote. Well, you going to tell us? You know the story. Well, I know the story, but anyway, it's um, it's Rahab. Uh, I believe it's in the book of Judges. I think. Let me see. Praise I thought God. I wrote it down. You but did I did. write it down. I wrote it somewhere. Might be in my other book down here. Let me see. I got two of them. Praise God. But okay. Go ahead, honey. Wow. The Asher pole. Uh, the Ash the the um the Asher pro. Uh in, in, in the scriptures, the groves in the English vernacular a translation for the Hebrew term Asherah, which signifies a wooden or uh, idol. Um, and, and, and whenever a grove is mentioned in the Bible, it, it, the context is idolatry. Now, I did get mm. that in my notes and in my study. I mm. was, we was looking at that. But anyway, um, uh, Rahab worshipped the same God, mm. the God of the Canaanites. Now, listen, I got to, I got to tell y'all that. Wait a minute, y'all. <laughs> I got to tell you. Praise God. Hold on. She was a harlot. She was a prostitute. She was a prostitute. She worshipped the God of Asher. Okay, it's in it's in Joshua six. Let's go to Joshua six real quick. Joshua. Let's go to Joshua six real quick. We was in Judges, but we're gonna go. I want to show y'all what the Holy Ghost showed us. I was blown away. Joshua six. Joshua six. When the Holy Ghost dropped this uh, in our spirit, Joshua six. It was, I, I was, I, 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 I opened God. my mouth, my mouth dropped. I was saying, whoa, Joshua 6. Which verse? Okay. Oh, now Joshua had commanded the people saying, you shall. Okay. Um, okay. Now Jericho was securely shut up. Joshua 6, I'm starting at the, at the front. Okay. Uh, okay. Now Jericho was securely shut up because of the children of Israel. None went out and none came in. And the Lord said to Joshua, see, I have given Jericho unto your hand. It's king and it's mighty men of valor. You shall march around the city. All you men of war, you shall go around the city. Once this, you shall do six days. Um, I'm trying to, I th I mean, maybe I done got off, but I'm trying to. Yeah, Find yeah, out where yeah. Rahab was, but yeah, she yeah. got to be. Hold on. I want to go where what Rahab did. Praise God. Hallelujah. Uh, hold on, y'all. I'm trying to. I apologize. Um, I thought I wrote it down. Yeah, I got it. 17. Okay, now let's see what shall we do. Okay. That's it. All right. You got it? I think I do. Um and Joshua rose early in the morning, and the priest took up the ark of the Lord. And uh, this is in 12. I thought I wrote that scripture down. I must have got so excited that I thought I wrote it down, y'all, and I didn't write nothing down. Um, and it came to pass at the seventh day that they arose, and about, uh, no, I miss Rahab. I want to get Rahab. Where? Where? What's that? It's Rahab's household is spared. But I wanted to get to where she was um, uh, har um, the harlot. Well, it's in the book of Joshua. Anyway, Rahab was a prostitute, all right? And Rahab is the one that, um, that when the spies went in, Rahab hid them on top of the roof. She hid them. She hid the spies. Hold on. Rahab. Read that. He had the spies. I wanted to read it. Y'all bear with me, please. He had the messages. Where is that? That we sent. Uh-huh. Okay, but that's the bottom part of it. Rahab, he had the, he had the, she hit them. Okay? When she hit them, she say, uh, uh, she hid the spies. And so when the, when the people from Jericho came up, when they came up, when the people from Jericho came up, what happened? Okay? When they came up, uh, Rahab said, y'all come on up here. 
-hmm. and she put them up under some flax. Y'all read the story. She they put them up under some. She put them up under some flax. So Rahab, the prostitute, the Bible mm -hmm. say, her house was on the on on, the, on by the wall, mm -hmm. and 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 she uh, uh, hid the spies. Okay, so when the spies conversed with Rahab. She said, um, you know, I done heard about, you know, y'all uh, uh, killing people and your gods and everything. Mm -hmm. And uh, I want y'all to save me and my family, you know, because because I done heard y'all. So mm -hmm. so what she did was Rahab took a scarlet rope, a red rope. Mm -hmm. She took the red rope. And when the when the when the when the uh, uh, Jericho authorities came looking for the spies, she hit them on top of the roof. And so she told them, she said, they don't went over here that way. They gone this way and that way. They gone. I don't even know where they at. But they was up there on top of the roof. Mm -hmm. So she took the red cord. Uh huh. And she said, now this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to lower y'all down by this red cord. I'm going to lower y'all down. Go into the cave. Stay there in the cave for three days. Mm -hmm. Stay over there for three days. Don't come out for three days mm -hmm. until them people don't come back from watching after y'all. Mm -hmm. And so the spies said to her, they said, because you done done this, that when, when we come in to take the city, when we come in here to take this city, mm -hmm. we are going to save you. Use this same red cord and put it outside the window. And, but all your family got to be in the house. If your family is not in the house, we ain't responsible. So what did Rahab do? Rahab and the spies of Israel made a covenant made that a day. Covenant. They came into a covenant agreement that day. Mm. If you do this, I'm going to do that. If you mm. do this, I'm going to do that. So Rahab said, okay, so what happened with Rahab? This what happened with Rahab. Rahab put that scarlet rope thing down the window. So everybody in Israel who was fighting, when they saw the covenant that they had made with the spies, they didn't kill nobody in her house. Nobody. They destroyed all of Jericho, mm. took all of their money and took all of their wealth, but they didn't do not one thing mm. to Rahab and her house. Now remember, Rahab was a prostitute. Was a prostitute. Rahab worshipped Asherah. Asherah. She was worshiping the Canaanite God. Remember I told y'all the Canaanite, the Canaanite, see that? That's ancient Canaan. I don't know if you can see it. Ancient Canaan. That's the goddess in the grove that Rahab worshiped this thing. That's why Rahab was a prostitute. She worshiped this thing. She worshiped other gods. She, was a, she worshiped the God of the Canaanites. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Praise anyway, God. Um, listen what happened. I would always ask him. Mm. I would say, the Bible say, oh, thank you, Miss Marlene. The Bible say that David was a man after God's own oh, heart. God. He was a man after, I would ask him, well, if David was a man after God's own heart, why did he kill Uriah the Hittite? Why did he kill Uriah the Hittite and take his wife Bathsheba? Mm. Why did he do that if he was a god after God's own oh, heart? Why, how is that? Mm. How is that possible? That if you are a person after God's own heart, that you can go in and steal a man's wife, kill him, put him on the front line? How can you do that? The altar. The altar. Of the Call altar was speaking still. Speaking to him. You know why the altar was speaking still? Because Rahab was King David's great, great, great grandmother. Mm. That spirit was still, that thing was still speaking. That's why David could do what he did. So it was in the bloodline. It was in the bloodline. Mm. That altar was like still Gideon speaking. Like Gideon destroyed the, the, the altars in his father's bloodline. Yes, he destroyed the altars in his father's bloodline. But that's why a man after God's own heart, that's why we can be so saved and sanctified and mm. filled with the spirit, but that Asherah pole still speaking. Still speaking. It's still speaking. Praise. It drew a king. It's right there. It drew a king to murder. It drew a king to murder. The Asherah pole. The Asherah pole. If it can draw a king to murder, what it can draw you to do? Uh huh. Because here's the, here's the lineage. Boaz was the father of Obed. Oh. Obed. Wasn't it Obed? Yeah. Boaz was the father of Obed. Obed was, I wrote it down. Obed, uh-huh. Boaz was the father of Obed. 
Obed was the father of Jesse. Jesse was the father of David. Okay. Boaz was Rahab's. Uh, let's see. Rahab boy. Boaz. Okay. Boaz mama. Rahab. Mm. That was Boaz mama. Wow. Rahab. The same woman that was worshiping idols. Wow. Worshiping that Asherah pole. Wow. And that altar was still speaking against mm. David. Mm. That's why a man, the Lord showed it to us. That's why a man after God's own, own heart, heart can commit murder the way that he did that. How mm. was it possible? A man who write all the songs. Because altars are powerful they once are they powerful. activate it. How do you activate the altar? By obeying the altar, by worshiping the altar, by doing what the altar tells you to altar. do, by feeding the altar. That's how you do it. My God. Oh, mm, my goodness. My God. Oh, and wait a minute. All right. That's the other image. That's what, the other image. What's, what that. you see on this thing? Look at the breast. That's another carved wooden image of the Asherah. Mm. See? And look, and look down there at the middle. That's why I said parental discretion is advised. Mm. Look down there at the middle. What do you see? Mm. Look at that. Look at that. This is what we worshiping. That's right. That's in the spirit this realm. This in the spirit realm. You can't see it. That's how that's looking in the spirit but realm. But the fruit of it, when you're showing, when you showing all your breasts, when you're showing all your breasts to the world, mm. you're worshiping the goddess. See, mm. Beyonce don't care nothing about worshiping the goddess. That's why she show her breasts. Right. Nicki Minaj show her breasts because she worshiping the goddess. Yeah. We are daughters of Zion. We are not supposed to do this. But you know why we doing it? Because that altar of perversion altar. is speaking. It's speaking. It's pulling you. It's pulling you to it. It's calling you. It's calling your name. Praise it's God. It's calling you. And because you have not crucified your flesh and gone after this altar to disconnect yourself from the altars of the Asherah poles, mm -hmm. okay, this thing is still speaking in your life. Right. This altar. This altar is probably, still probably speaking in, every, in your life. every lineage. In every lineage. I want you to get a good look at it. See it? See the boobs? See the opening there? It's a sexual thing. It's a sexual Perverted. Thing. Perverted. Perversion. This is the altar. Praise God. Perversion. Perversion. This That's spirit. why we having problems. That's why we continue Hallelujah. to have the same patterns and cycles. Because we have not disconnected ourselves Praise from God. the altar of perversion. Praise the God. altar of the Asherah pole. This is the problem Praise right God. here. This the problem. We can't, we Praise can't continue to do this. Hallelujah. And let me tell you how you worship it. Praise God. You worship this thing through music. Mm -hmm. You worship it through music. Mm -hmm. Remember I just told MTV. you. MTV. MTV. The, 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 the bad bib the old boys. They say this girl is poison. Why would I want to listen to anything that's telling me the girl is poison? Why? She bad. That's what they saying. But they all over there. She but they all over it. They all over See, there. See, it's that altar right there that they worship. And every time mm. you play that music, that's the altar you bow to. Every time you, every look, time at that you program, look at that program, that's the altar that you bow to. Every time you look at it's power, the Asherah pole. Praise My God. My God. Praise God. Remember, Boaz uh, was uh, Rahab's... Um, yeah. This is the, the Asher pole. Like, uh -huh. remember, I said it's something. It's something calling you to dress like the stripper it's and something the prostitute. Oh, it's something causing it's something me to dress that. like the and stripper. And then look, the altar. You just got to talk about the altar led David to murder. The altar led David to murder. Led David to murder. He was a man after God's own, own heart, heart. But this altar led him to murder. Praise God, because he had an extreme lust and a desire for this man wife. He did. For this man, wife. Yeah. He he sent for her. He he did what? He sent for her. Oh my Go God. get it. He he asked. Uh huh. Who, who, is, who that? is that? That's your royal wife. That's your royal wife. And he sent for her. Uh huh. He sent for because of the burning lust. My God. That was in him. Praise God. Because of this altar. Uh -huh. Because of the altar. It, he didn't know it, but it was in his bloodline. Yes. It was the altar in his bloodline. was still speaking. He was part, he was part of the bloodline that had prostitution in it. 
prostitution. That Canaanite altar. That Canaanite altar. That Canaanite God. goddess. That Canaanite goddess. goddess. See that? Keep showing it. See that it Canaanite It triggered goddess? all the way down to him, and he was a king. He was a king, but that altar was Praise still speaking. God. And then the altar tried to get him to cover it up and hide it. Cover up and hide it. Praise God. My Hallelujah. Shate kele mo kokolo Who my who? Praise God. But he was a man. Of the, who are the reflection? Who are the reflection of the goddess Asher? Uh huh. Who? In the earlier time, groves are mentioned in connection with religious worship. The heathen concentrated groves to particular gods, and for this reason, they were forbidden. They were forbid, praise uh -huh. God, to the Jews. Uh -huh. These gods. Yes, they, they were forbid. They were forbid. The Asherah pole. They, these gods. The stripper pole right other, now the today. The stripper pole. The stripper pole. You don't have to go to the you strip ain't club. You to the strip club. Okay? She on the TV. She on the TV. She's showing you everything on the TV. Praise God. But you think it's innocent. Yeah. But you sit there and you ingest right. that. That's going into your spirit. That's going into your spirit, praise It's going to affect your life in some kind of I way. Mean. It's going to blind you. It's causing a snare. Come on, she it's causing a trap, talk. praise God. Mm -hmm. I know you're looking at the woman on Housewives and Los Angeles Wild, all these wives and stuff. And the way they dress, they, they yeah. seductive. They look they, good. They, 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 they dress so short, they sit down, you're going to see everything. My God. Praise God. That's a spirit. Yes, it is. That's Asherah mm -hmm. moving about, praise God. She in Chicago. She in New York. Uh -huh. She in San Diego. Yeah. She in Baltimore. Uh -huh. She all over the world, praise yes, God. She, she in Iraq. She in Dubai. Where she at? She in Dubai, praise uh -huh. God. What causes all this trafficking? She in your phone. She in your phone. She on your computer. She there. Praise Asher. God. Listen. She there. She there. She there. Look, she there. Praise God. She there. She there. Look at that thing. She there. That's the Asherah pole, the wooden thing that they, they was worshiping back in the Canaanite day. Mm. That's an ancient Canaan. Praise God. See, we're not telling you something to take away your fun. No. We're telling you something to help you. This is what the Lord dropped in our spirit. This going to drag you into hell. My this going to drag You're you into compromise. bondage. This going to reduce you to starvation. We don't want to do this. This going to reduce you to starvation. Come out. The starvation is in your spirit. Yes. Your spirit dying. Yes, it's dying. It reducing you, praise God, to the elements, to the things of the world. Uh huh. Praise this, God. This this Asherah thing right here. This is what will keep you out of the presence of God. Yes. You won't have a consistent prayer praise life. Praise God. You won't have a, a a time where you can get and you can get before the Lord. You won't do Thank it. You, you know what? Because you worshiping this thing. Thank you, Jesus. You worshiping that thing right there. That's Thank what you, it Jesus. is, a thing. This is what the Holy Ghost Dude, showed us. That's right. My we're God. not, we like my wife said, we're not trying to stop you from having your phone, but we we trying to, we're not talking about these people. We're talking about what they represent and what is in them, praise God. Mm -hmm. It's gonna pull you down. But what we got so many young girls getting pregnant. Yeah. So many young girls that had babies. Yeah. Why? Because of this astral. Yeah, this because we align them the, to see this the in our in, home. The influence. Yeah, we have the influence. We align them to see this in our home. How are you Praise using God. your influence? How are you using your influence? We promoting it. I was on um on Instagram, uh huh, uh -huh and it was a prominent. It was uh, on Instagram, and it was a prominent uh, uh 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 speaker. Prominent. This person had incredible, incredible influence. Okay, mm. she was on there. Uh huh. She was on there. She wasn't married or nothing, mm. but she was on there and she had um, all her cleavage showing. All of it was showing. And I sent a message to her mm. and I said, with the influence that you have, I don't want my granddaughter to see you. Mm. I don't want my great granddaughter <clears throat> to see, what, see you. I don't want her to see you. I said, this is not right. I, 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 wrote, I wrote a note. I wrote the lady a note. She didn't take it down. She listened. She listened. That lady listened. Praise God, she listened. I said, you are influencing a generation. That's right. You influencing people. You influencing people. We are influencing people. We influencing people. People watching us. People watch you. They watch you. Praise God. And know who we representing? The kingdom. The kingdom of God. We don't represent this. We out to destroy that. We out to destroy. We, we don't represent. To destroy that. We don't represent that. 
Parental discretion Praise is advised. God. If you have children, parental discretion is advised. We don't worship this. We don't worship that. You know what? We don't show the world our nakedness. You know why? Because we daughters mm. of Zion. Of Zion. I remember one time I was on Facebook. I was on Facebook. And when I was on Facebook, uh, somebody put on something. I thought it was funny. I, I promise you, I thought it was, I was, I was, I was rolling, laughing at it. And I even made a comment like, this is hilarious. Uh, put the thing up there. Oh, I can't believe it. Da, 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 da. Later on that day, the Holy Spirit spoke to me and he said this. I will never forget it. Mm. He said, daughters of Zion don't laugh at nasty things. Mm. We don't laugh at nasty things. Mm -hmm. We don't show our cleavage to the world, not daughters of Zion. We got to come out of the world all the way. Come out from among them, he said. If you are a friend of the world, you are enemy to God. Come out of the world. Mm -hmm. You are being influenced by Asherah through the movies, through the music, yeah. through the television through programs, the television. through the through your phone. Ride down the interstate, be a boy. The be a boy. The your all, cell phone. You know what they do? They bombard us your with computers. actual. They bombard us with nakedness. Praise God. They bombard us with the nakedness. Commercials. See, see commercials. I, we don't, as daughters of Zion, we don't want to show the world our nakedness. Mm. You know what we want to be? We want to be chaste virgins before the Lord. Chase we virgin. want to be pure before the Lord. You see, hmm. we want that's how we want to be pure before Praise the God. Lord. So if you if you come on here and you you done done that, just say, Lord, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's it. Forgive it ain't me. no big deal. Lord, Praise I'm God. sorry. And, and if you're struggling with that, if you struggle, say, Lord, help me. Help me. Go on a fast. Give me strength. Uh huh. If so, you're struggling with lust, help me. Help me. Give me strength. Mm -hmm. You struggle with porn, help me. Give me strength. Mm -hmm. God not going to turn you away. God looking. He got his hand up. To receive you, praise God. Mm -hmm. Deuteronomy 7, 5 said, this is what you are to do. What it say? To them. What you, what you supposed to do? Break down their altars. Break it down. Break it down, praise God. He said, this is what you ought to do to them. Praise God. He telling us what to do to them. To break down them altars, praise God. God. But we have to break down the altars in the spirit realm. In the spiritual realm. We got to go in the spirit realm. We got to break these altar down in the spirit realm. Once you break it down in the spirit realm, it have no function, praise God, in the natural, natural realm. It won't have no function. It have no function in the natural realm if you break it in the spirit realm, praise God. But it takes authority, praise God. It takes commitment. It takes dedication, praise God. Life. It takes concentrated life. It takes a right standing with God, praise God, to be able to do that, praise God, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. And That's why I said a lust of the flesh, a lust of the pride of life, praise uh -huh. This Asherah. This Asherah. This Asherah, praise this God. That, the queen of heaven. The queen this of heaven. that deity. Praise God. Uh -huh. Break down in, the altar. In the ESV, this, uh, I really it like mean? this. It says, what it say? but thus shall you deal with them. Deal with them. If you don't deal with the altars, the altars going to deal, deal with, with you. you. If we don't deal with these altars, they going to the deal altars with you. are going to deal with us. Praise you God. see, you say, why I got set back? Why is my finances out of whack? Mm. You cursing that when you when you uh, uh, pay homage to this thing and you say you a Christian, that's what they know what the demons do. They say, oh, you say you a Christian. Praise God. You call your, you a prophet and all of that. And you got your, you, 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 you a, 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 a pastor and preacher and teacher and evangelist and the fivefold ministry. You all that. Well, since you name the name of Christ and since you say you a Christian and you still are under my influence, mm. I'm going to take whatever I can from Praise you. Praise God. I'm going to get whatever I can. I might not get you with your finances, but I'm going to get you some other way. I'm going to blind area. you in other areas. Yeah. I'm going to blind you spiritually. Mm. I'm going to have you doing all kind of things. Praise I'm going to have a spirit of greed on your life. Mm. I'm going to do all of that, and you won't even see it. Praise God. We're trying to help you. Praise. Break down their altars. Uh -huh. He said, smash their sacred stones. Smash them. Smash them, praise God. My God. He said, cut down their asher poles. Cut them down. And burn their idols in the fire. Burn them in the fire. Burn them in the fire, praise uh -huh. God. He said, break down their altars, smash their sacred stones, cut down their asher poles, and burn their idols in 
in the fire, praise my God. God. Jeremiah 23, 29 say, is not my word like a fire? Uh-huh. And like a hammer, uh -huh. the bust up stuff. Yeah, in the, the spirit. Bust up stuff in the spirit realm. The, the bust spirit. up stuff in the spirit uh -huh. realm, praise God. Destroy them in the spirit. You got a hammer. My God. Praise God in the name of the Lord Jesus. To destroy these wicked altars, praise God. Yes. Hallelujah, praise God. Michael, Michael 5, 14. He said, I will uproot from you your asher poles when I demolish your cities. What did it say? I will uproot. From you, your astral your pose, astral pose uh -huh. when I demolish your city, uh -huh. praise God. Uh -huh. It's astral pose, it's stripping poles in every city. Every city. Every city, My praise God. God. It's stripper pose. That Asher roam in every city, every state, every nation, praise God. Mm. Hallelujah. It's causing divorce. It's causing separation. It's causing division, praise God. Hallelujah. Deuteronomy 12 and 3 says, Break down their altars. Same mm -hmm. thing. Same thing. Smash their sacred stones. Uh -huh. And burn their asher poles in the fire. Cut down the idols of their gods. And wipe out their names from those pillars. Wipe out their names wipe from their those name places. Wipe them out, praise God, in the name mm -hmm. of Jesus. Wipe out their names, praise God. God. Wipe out their diligence, praise God. Wipe out these names that come in and attacking the family. Come in and attacking your son. Come in and attacking your kid. Come in and attacking your marriage, praise God. In the name of Jesus. Causing your son to want to go some other way. Causing your daughter to want to go some other way. Uh -huh. Praise it's God. Asher it's the Asher pool. It's Thank the Asher report. Got them confused, praise God. Don't know what they are. Mm -hmm. Praise God. It's the Asher pole, praise mm -hmm. God. In the name of the Lord that's Jesus. That's what the enemy want to keep us in. Thank you, He want to keep us in that seduction. He yes. want to keep us in that perversion. And he want to he want to prostitute us. Thank that's you, That's what Jesus. he want to use us for. Praise he want to use us for prostitution. This what? This what God did. What? God destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah. Mm -hmm. Praise God. That's what we're going on now. Mm -hmm. The Asher. The Asher, the Asher, praise, praise God. Yeah. All kind of sex, all kind of junk going on. Yes. There, praise God. Mm -hmm. And God got fed up with it. Yes, he did. Praise God. Hallelujah. Just like he's doing with us today. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. God is coming back for a chaste version. He's coming back for purity. He's coming back for the for the holiness. He, we got to come out of there. We got to come all the way out of the world. We can't keep babbling in the world. We can't keep worshiping these things. Thank you, Jesus. We can't keep worshiping Asher. Asherah. This is what Asa did. What Asa did? He said he even disposed his grandmother, Martha, from her position as queen, as queen mother uh -huh. because she had a repulsive image. A repulsive a image. A repulsive image for the worship of Asherah. Asa cut it down. Asa cut it down. Asa cut it down uh -huh. and burn it in the Kidron Valley. Burn it in the Kidron Valley. Yeah. It's, it, it's grandmother. It's grandmother. He didn't care nothing about his grandma. He ain't care. He said, you're not going to do this. You ain't finna do this. You're not going to do this here. Uh-huh. Not bring this repulsive this re image, image. This repulsive death. This repulsive God. My God. He, 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 his grandmother. His grandmother. Praise God. Mm -hmm. He burned it down. Praise God. 2 Kings 23, 15. Mm -hmm. He said, even the altar at Bethel, the high place, made by Jeroboam, son of Nebat, who had caused Israel to sin. Yes. Even that altar mm -hmm. and high place mm -hmm. and ground and ground it to powder and burnt the Asher poles also. My God. The Asher poles, they're everywhere. They the Asher everywhere. poles are everywhere, everywhere. praise God. They're everywhere. They're in Baltimore, they're in Chicago, mm -hmm. they're in New York, Florida. they're in Las Vegas, uh -huh. they're in Las Vegas. Yes, they're in Florida. They're in Florida, now, praise now, God. Now, now, here we go. How in mm. the world mm, 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 do mm. we get this thing yes. out of our lives? Out of our lives. How do we smash these demonic patterns Me so that are continuing to show themselves you, in Jesus. our lives that we can't get a part of them? Mm. You got to go in the realm of the spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Through consecration. Through consecration. Come away from the Facebook news feed. Thank you, Jesus. Facebook is a news feed. Get it? Feed. Yes. Feed. It's feeding. It'll feed y'all kind of Take some junk. time away from Facebook. Consecrate yourself. Take a fast mm. and go to the Lord and say, Lord, I'm guilty. I'm, I'm guilty, guilty. Of, of dressing like this. Praise God. I'm guilty of showing my nakedness. Thank I'm you, Jesus. guilty. I'm guilty. Y'all don't think we, I did it. I Praise did God. it. I'm guilty. We guilty of this mess. I, I said, I'm guilty of worshiping this thing. We guilty of worshiping that mess. I'm, I'm guilty, Lord. I'm I say, guilty. I say, I'm sorry. 
Praise God. I'm sorry. I, I'm I repent. guilty. I, re, I renounce. I, I, I ask you forgive me, Thank Lord. You, Jesus. For, 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 for every time for worshiping this thing. Praise God. Forgive me, Lord, for forgive worshiping, me for worshiping this Asherah, Asherah, this goddess. Lord, this goddess. Praise this, God. This altar. That forgive I worship. Me. I did worship that. I did Praise worship. Praise God. That. You need to admit that you worship any things. Yes. You worship anything whether you admit, admit it or, or not. not. Praise God. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. You need to watch very carefully watch how them. you allow your young daughter to come out the house because some old man will have your daughter. Yes. Some old man, May your daughter, advantage. 15 years old. Some, jo yeah, some joker have your daughter, 30 years old. Mm -hmm. Yeah. May take advantage. May take advantage of, of your daughter. Child. Praise God. Mm -hmm. How did, because With, of the way they lead a the house dress. Uh -huh. So if you know, when you when you look in the mirror. Now, come on, ladies. Thank you, Jesus. Come on, ladies. You know how you look. We can't even help. We're trying to help our men okay. out now. We, we, we're trying to help them. All right. You can still, you know, look nice and you can still be trendy mm. without showing your naked. Praise God. You can still honor the Lord Mr. without Mr. showing your naked. Without showing your naked. You can do that. Man. Okay. Stay away. Thank you, Lord. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. See that devil? That devil mad. Hey, my that son, that devil mad. Sante. That's all right. That's all right. Oh, cool. That no devil Sante. mad. It's mad. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Turn Lord Jesus. Turn the other one around. Yes, I take it, Lisa. There you go. Thank you, Jesus. See, what well, this is what we got to do. Thank All you, right? Jesus. This is what we got to do. Thank you, We got Jesus. to help each other. Thank you, Jesus. We got to help each other. We here to help. Poco we just here to help. We just, we here, just here, to help. here to help. Praise God. That's it. We just here to help. Praise God. This how I am uh -huh. with my wife. What? If my wife got something on, I said, where you going to wear that at? You must be going to wear that in the house. She said, oh, I'm just, I'm just got this on. I said, I know. That's all. You just got that on because you ain't going nowhere else to win it. Yeah, that's what he said. You're you going to wear that in the house. I said, I'm going to put a camera on. You know why? You know why? Because uh, no other man is supposed to see my wife nakedness. No other man? I can show that man my no cleavage. Other wife, no other man is supposed to have his eyes on my wife nakedness. And I'm the one with the responsibility. I'm the one with the authority to praise God. In the man, if you don't say that, that's up to you. But I'm going to say something to my wife because God gave me that responsibility. God gave me that me. power to cover her, to praise God, to be her high priest. Yes. So I'm going to be the high priest. I'm not going to be the low priest. That's a low priest to allow your wife to go out the house looking like a, 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 a prostitute. Like this. Like that. Praise God. See? Like that. That's don't, it right there. Don't take it the wrong way. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Don't take it the wrong way, praise. I'm just trying to help you. I'm trying to help you. Praise God, because I would want you to help me. I would. I would want you Tell to help me. me. Tell, Tell me, me, praise God, what I need to do. Please. I would want you to help me, Tell praise me. God. I pull Sakele me. Tell me. me. Don't My let Kelly me go. Sante, me see Don't Sante. let me go. Hey, Kelly you can come to me, praise God. You can God. come and tell I, me. You can come tell me, praise uh, God. I may not like it. I may not like but it. But I'm going to take the but, cut. But I'm going to take it, I'm praise take God. It. If oh, you come in, Jesus. Hey, I might not like it. Praise God. But if you come to me, but help you're me. my friend. That's right. I'm going to let you cut me. I'm going to let you if cut me. If you're my friend and you and I know you love me, I'm going to let I'm going to go ahead on and take the cut. Praise God. Hallelujah. If I if if you my friend and I know you love me, Miss Jada. Miss Jada, I saw you um, at the grocery store the other day. And uh, I said, Miss Jada, you had Thank all you your Jesus. cleavage out. I did. Oh, cool. all of it. Oh, Lord, I'm so sorry, Jesus. Lisa, take care of oh, Lord, Lord, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Thank First you, thing Jesus. I'm going to do, because I'm tied to the Asherah pole, I'm going to get mad you, at you. Jesus. I'm going to get mad at you for telling Praise me Praise God. You're going to get mad. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to appreciate you for I'm telling me what? The truth. The truth. I want you to Praise tell God. me the truth. Tell me. Miss Jada, look now. You cutting up. All right? And we should accept that in love. Look now. All right? You know. If you want to wear... if I, I don't have no problem with this. If you want to wear a nice dress or something like that, and, and the dress is um, uh, 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 a form-fitting dress, and you go into church, just put a, um, uh, what do you call them? Praise God. A cover-up over it, like a, a, a cardigan. You can wear a cardigan over it and still look nice and polished and everything. Yeah. You can still look good. You ain't got to do God. all that. You know, I ain't trying to tell you to, to be... Uh, <laughs> You know, but what we want to do is we want to help you. We want to help and we you. We want to dress like the kingdom. 
Praise we want to dress like the kingdom. We need a class. It's, it's, it's really true. We as Christian women, we need a class on Christian etiquette and what we should look like mm -hmm. in church, how we should come to church. Christian women. Now, I ain't talking about no people that ain't saved and they trying to Christian give their life women. to Christ. We ain't trying to judge them people that Praise coming in God. there cutting up and messed up. They don't know. Okay, we're going to love on them and we're going to keep them. But the Christian women that's coming in the church, you know, help a brother out. Help a brother help, out. Help my, help my husband out. I don't help want my husband out. to be looking at you. Come on now. I don't want my husband looking at you. And we friends on Facebook, I got to come down the news feed. My yeah. husband friend with you too. Yeah. And he got to come down the news feed. Yeah. And he got to get a boom. He got to get this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He got to get that. My God. Jesus. Well, we going to go, y'all. Yeah. Um, we've been here for a minute here. I don't Praise know if you mean to stay here that long. Thank but we've been here. Y'all like the video. Share the video. Share the video. Uh, we on YouTube at Praise Will of God. the Lord Deliverance Ministry. God has been really good to us within the last, I don't know, last, uh, the last week. We got like... Uh, 19 uh 15 15 new subscribers praise god praise god Thank so god is moving god is uh uh, uh doing what he want to do and we praise know god. that everything happens in times and seasons praise god so we just sit here we wait on the lord wait we put the, the sacrifice on the altar we get up at 5 30 like praise he instructed god. us to and we come in to tell you we know that um it's hard and we know that um we're here to give you the truth. We, but we're here to tell you the truth because we're trying Praise to help God. you. I'm not, we're no, not here to compromise with you. We're not here to compromise We're, trying, we're giving it to you straight and we ain't putting no we're chase in We're here to in. tell you the truth. We're here to tell you the truth because we want... I'm still going to love you. I'm going to still love you. you be mad, I'm still going to love you. Now, yeah. Praise I'm God. I'm going to still love, love you. you. Now, if, you, if I Praise see you coming God. down my news feed and, and, and I see all of... And, and I see Asherah and I yeah. see Asherah, I'm just going to snooze you for 30 days because I don't want to see it. You know, I don't. I don't think it's for kingdom women to do. So Praise we need a, a a a class on Christian etiquette. Praise I God. wish somebody would come up with the idea. Praise God, Father. We thank you for your word. We thank you for the word that will be in release. That will release here today, Father. It will not return void. It will accomplish the thing it was sent out to do, Father, in the name of Jesus. And we. Speak a special blessing on everybody that came on, Father, in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Father, that would be insight and revelation, praise God, that would enlighten them, praise God. Their eyes will be open, their ears will be open, their hearts will be open, praise God, to receive this word, Father, Father, and then redirect their direction, Father, by the power of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name, amen. We love y'all. Y'all have a great resurrection weekend resurrection uh, you know enjoy your family have a good time and 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 just you know love on jesus it's resurrection sunday coming up tomorrow and we just Praise thank god. god for who he is we bless y'all in the name of the lord and we're gonna go bye now Oh, sorry, guys. Uh, and five.